All right, we're going to take a look at the Nest iOS thermostat um, app. This is the uh, main dashboard. It shows your outside temperature and your weather condition for your home. If you click on home, you can switch it from home or away, or you can let it automatically do that for you, which um, is what I do. And then on the right, you'll see your thermostats. I only have one, so I'll click on that. And this is where you can set and modify your temperature. So you can move it up or down um, depending on your needs. And this is, can all be done remotely. You can scroll to the left and you'll see the inside humidity, the outside temperature, which is good information. The top right will look at the uh, energy history. This shows um, blue, shows your um, cooling system and orange for heating to see how long it ran for any given day. And you can collect your leaves here as well. And then under that, we've got the schedule. So these are the um, scheduled temperatures that the Nest automatically put in for my system. Um, if you want to modify these, you can go into each uh, item here, each line item, and either delete, remove, or you can even modify them up or down depending on your needs. Very easy to uh, modify. And then we'll look at the uh, fan. So if you want your system to run the fan for a few minutes, you can have it do that for you automatically right here. And then we'll go to the um, settings for the heat and cool. So you can choose to uh, have heat on, cooling, or both heat and cool. Um, or you can have it off completely. At the bottom left, we've got some... Uh, thermostat settings we can modify. So you can choose where the thermostat's installed or you can add a label to it. You can set your away temperatures. And then you've got your Nest Sense. And these are all the uh, smart technologies that it's using. Ready indicates that it's actually ready to start using that technology and then learning. It's it's still learning what your um, how you want your you know, home to be. So if it's still learning, it's not going to start using that technology yet. Um, or maybe it's not going to use it fully. So it may take up to a week for uh, to learn your uh, heating and cooling needs before it starts using that technology. And you can see the air wave and uh, heat pump balance are still in the learning phase. And then we'll uh, go back out of here. fan. Um, this is like a scheduled fan so you can have it run daily just to keep your house um, in good con working condition. Equipment, you can look at the wiring. Um, if you want to, you can change your uh, heating or cooling systems here. So if you swap it out for something else, you can do that. Air filter reminders and safety temperatures, all that can be set here too. Uh, technical information shows your firmware versions and software versions, um, IP address, when it made last contact, um, and also the battery voltage. So the Nest has a battery built in, so if the power does go out, it'll continue to work. Um, so you can st still see what the temperature is inside your home. And then the uh, there's also the lock. You can set a pin so that you can lock someone out, or maybe if you've got some kids, you don't want them messing with the thermostat, you can uh, have that locked out for them. But that's uh, pretty much it. That's the uh, app, and uh, you can read the full detailed review at geekinspector.com.